Hello everyone. In this video, we shall learn about the Zoho Expense HSBC integration. With this integration, you can make online reimbursements for your employees directly from Zoho Expense. Firstly, let's see how to set up your integration. Log into your Zoho Expense account. Go to the admin view. Click the gear icon in the top right corner. Click online reimbursements under integrations. Go to HSBC. Click enable integration. If you had already received the credentials for the integration from HSBC, click yes. If you don't have the necessary credentials to integrate Zoho Expense with HSBC, click no and select open HSBC contact form. In the form that opens, you can provide your organization and contact details. A relationship manager will get in touch with you to help you create a new HSBC corporate account and provide the credentials required for the integration. If you already have a HSBC account, they will help you receive the credentials required for the integration. Once you have the credentials to integrate with HSBC, you can fill them in this page after clicking Yes. Enter your profile ID, client ID, client secret, the HSBC bank account from which the reimbursement must be initiated, the HSBC public key, which will be shared as a file with you through your email, and the secret pin, which will help you initiate reimbursements from Zoho Expense. Next, agree to the terms and conditions and click Save. You've successfully set up your account to process your employees' reimbursements directly into their bank accounts. Please note that you will not be able to edit these credentials in Zoho Expense once you've set up the integration. To edit, you will need to delete the integration and set up once again with the new credentials. Next, the employee should add the details of the bank account to which they can receive reimbursements. To do this, click My Settings in the left sidebar. Select Add Bank Account, enter your bank details and click Save. Now let's see how you can reimburse your employees directly into their bank accounts. Click Admin View. Go to Reports. Navigate to the Awaiting Reimbursements tab. Click the report that you want to reimburse. Click the Reimburse drop-down and select Via HSBC. Under the From Account drop-down, select the account from which you are reimbursing. Choose the transaction type and enter a note regarding the reimbursement if required. If the reimbursement amount is less than 2 lakh rupees, you must choose NEFT. If it's more than 2 lakh rupees, you must reimburse it through RTGS. However, NEFT and RTGS have some limitations during bank holidays and the reimbursement initiated on the non-working hours of the bank. Additionally, only domestic transactions are supported for NEFT and RTGS. Click Reimburse. Enter the secret PIN that you've configured while setting up the integration. You have only five attempts to enter the right PIN. If you fail to do so, the integration will be marked inactive and you'll have to delete the integration and set it up again. The payment will be initiated once you authorize a payment in HSBC Net. If you've initiated a RTGS or NEFT payment from within Zoho Expense, you will have to authorize the payment using file level authorization. To do this, log into HSBC Net Go to the menu and select Payments and Transfers. Click File Authorization and you can view the files of the NEFT payments that you had initiated from Zoho Expense. Select the file and click Review Files. Click Authorize File to authorize a payment or you can click Reject File to reject. Once you authorize a file, the payment will be sent for further authorization. Once the authorization is complete, the reimbursement will reflect in the employee's account depending upon the type of transaction chosen. In case the payment fails, you can contact support at the rate zohoexpense.com to guide you further. If you want to stop making payments through your HSBC corporate account or change your account details, you can choose to disable the integration. Let's see how to do this. Click Admin View. Go to Settings on the left sidebar or click the gear icon on the top right side. Click Online Reimbursements under Integrations. Go to HSBC. Click Disable. Click here to confirm the action. The integration will be disabled and you can choose to set it up again if required. With this, we hope you've got a good understanding of the Zoho Expense HSBC integration. If you have any queries, do reach out to us at support at the rate zohoexpense.com.